Hello and welcome to this video tutorial to set path and class path for Java in Windows XP. I assume that Java SDK and Java Runtime environment is already installed on your system. Setting path for JDK and JRE is important for Java programs to compile and run. For the purpose of this tutorial, I am going to take a sample Java program. This sample Java program displays some output on the screen. Now I am going to compile this program. This shows errors saying that Java C is not an internal or external command. This is because of the reason that path for Java C and Java is not set. To set the path, you can select my computer, right, right click, select properties and in the advanced tab, click on the environment variables. In the environment variables, you have two options. You can set user variables or system variables. It is better to set path in the system's variables. You may or may not have path variable inside the system's variable tab. If you already have a path variable then you can edit or else you need to create by clicking new button. Now I will select path and click edit. You will find path in the variables name. As well as in variables value, you can find already existing path. Please do not remove this path. Instead, try to append this path with the path of the JTK and JRE. The next step is to find the physical path to the folder where JDK and JRE is installed. You can type the complete path, but it's better to browse to the location and copy the path. I have installed Java in C drive under program files. For JDK, I am going to browse till JDK bin folder and copy the entire path from the address bar. The next step is to paste it in the already existing path. Append the already existing path with a semicolon and then paste the copied path. For the JRE, we need to go till the JRE folder. Inside the JRE folder, open the bin folder, copy the entire path from the address bar and paste it or append it in the path variable followed by the semicolon. and click OK. Once the path is set, the next step is to set the class path. You may or may not have class path inside the systems variable tab. If you already have a class path, you can select and click edit or else you need to create by clicking new button. In my case, I do not have a class path variable defined. I will click new button and create a class path variable. In the variable values text box, I need to provide physical path for the folder where JDK and JRE is installed. I have installed JDK in program files Java JDK. Next step is to go till the JDK bin folder, copy the entire path from the address bar and paste it in the path class path variable. For JRE, you need to go back till the JRE folder, browse till the bin folder and copy the entire path and paste it or append it after the JDK's bin by using a semicolon followed by the path. And at the end, you need to make sure that you append semicolon and dot for the class path to work.
click OK. Click the environment variables uh, OK button to close the dialog as well as click the system properties OK. Close all the terminal in case they are open. Now to check whether path and class path is set properly, you can open a command prompt and then compile the Java file. The file gets compiled as well as you can execute the class file. In case if you get same error, then you need to recheck your Java path as well as Java class path. Thank you for taking time to watch this video.